her strength. Looks like she's holding me in. ourselves here, gentlemen. Never underestimate my boys, Ross. I guarantee you, Delta will give Salvatore a blow he'll not soon forget. Either that, or they'll end up like the two DEA teams before them, Norm. What are you talking about, Alan? Well, ask Jensen there. He oversaw the ops. Is it true? Why was I not made aware of it? A decision was made to deny any knowledge. Cut that disclaimer, horseshit, Jensen! Is it true what Alan was saying? Two teams. Twelve men each. So you're telling me that 24 men have died attempting the same mission? I'm afraid so. Cap, I just want to say I think we've got no business. Hutch, not now.
¡Apúrate! 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 ¡Quiero todos los americanos muertos! Aquilo, aquilo, Manuel, ¿dónde está usted? Venga rápido, los ciudadanos americanos, no estás más por aquí. Venga rápido, vámonos. Pero, venga. Ground zero and closing on target. Where the hell they all go? Take point. Right, Cap. Bombing. 
say happy. Happy. Bobby! Say birthday. Thanks, Cap. Let's do it. It's time to rock and roll! Watch your step, Doc. Don't worry about me. Just keep your eyes open. Clear. Pretty clean, Cap. Guess Salvatore never figured anyone would make it this far. Stay with me, okay? Stay with me. Clear. Hey, dirt. Man, this is a cokehead's wet dream. Not for long, it ain't. Hush, why is it so damn quiet out there? Nothing left to kill, Captain. Jump on the... You gotta stay with me, okay? Talk to me. Uh -huh. You gonna talk to me? Let's talk about... Let's talk about <laughs> Becky, okay? Talk to me about Becky. Stay with me, buddy. You gotta talk to me.
to the know the dealing with him because I mean this is you know this is a fucking insult man they insult me they insult my family find out how they know and find out now one comma eight billion stupid fucks who the fuck they think they're dealing with you just got yourself the world! The world has been left to speculate on the details of the raid, which reportedly destroyed a stockpile of cocaine with an estimated street value of $1.6 billion. It's rumored, however, that President Farrington will address the issue in his keynote speech at the UN later this week. In other news, War on drugs. Right. What a fucking joke. What's the problem, Hutch? Captain, this is not our fight. What have we ever been able to pick our own fights? Come on, Cap. War on drugs? We are just pissing in the wind. That's what burns me. What you talking about, Mac? He's talking about Lombardi in there, fighting for his life. Why, huh? Why? For what? Because some fat ass bureaucrat decided that fighting drugs is a fucking flavor of the goddamn month. You want to know what the bottom line is? That until you start writing the checks or calling the shots, you're under complete and total obligation to follow orders, period. I'm sorry, gentlemen. There's been no change. shit about satellites, but I got someone who does. I'm known as the hacker. I'm wanted by the FBI, the CIA, Interpol, Mossad, the Russians, the French, etc., etc., etc. Wanted for what? Cyber theft. Hmm. Hmm. I steal codes, verbal information. You know, all of them. Mabel's help, of course. Welcome to the 90s, my technologically challenged friends. The world is computerized, and it's all at my fingertips. Stocks, bonds, utilities, insurances, communication, even the military. If it's networked, it's accessible. With a few exceptions, of course. Once I'm in, People like Cell pay me to observe, to manipulate, to sabotage. Now, a couple of days ago, Cell came to me with this problem of yours, and here it is in all its glory. The Iris One constellation. Say hello to the American Navy's finest gents, the USS Roosevelt. The first in a brand spanking new class of ultra quiet attack subs. Ultra quiet attack subs. Why are you showing us this? What do the subs have to do with satellites? Chill! Who's, who's getting to that? You see, the Navy talks to its subs via another satellite network known as the SSIX. Mabel and I have cracked the SSIX, gents, which means I can talk to the subs.
start sending the message. defect in workmanship of the valves in the emergency system? Please test the system immediately and report any anomalies. That's what it says, Mr. Walcox, so I suggest we get to it. And if there is a problem, don't you think it would be better to know sooner than later? Okay, flood the tank so we can get on with this. Captain? Sir. Stand by to flood the tanks! All hands, this is the captain. We've been ordered to perform an emergency blow drill. To test for a possible defect in the system, back the hatches, men. We're taking the express elevator to the roof. Drill will commence when all sections are reported in. Captain out. Surface preparation. Prepare to surface. Prepare to surface.
Slab is secure. Forward weapons hatch open. Equipment's up and running. Oh, eight hours more or less. If you guys know what they're doing. They know how it. Believe me. They know. How many hours overdue is the transmission? Twenty-four. Theories? Well, she went down. She was torpedoed. If she's on the bottom, it'll take weeks to find her. Ah, oh, for God's sake. We're not at war. At least not yet. Lombardi's dead. Cap called. He died half an hour ago. Oh, Jesus, Paul. I'm so sorry. I told him to go. We were at the top of these stairs. And I told him to go first. And then I saw the laser tap him, and I told him to move, and he fucking froze. I told him to fucking move, and he froze. Honey, you did everything you could. This wasn't your fault. Maybe Max's right. Maybe this isn't our war. But right now, you know what I want? I want him dead. I don't care if they legalize drugs or they don't. I want Umberto Salvatore dead. God, it's Frank. What the hell? This is Umberto Salvatore. You're seeing live pictures from the USS Roosevelt. Surely you've been wondering what happened to the sun. <laughs> we'll wonder no more. It's mine. Get me a VPA now. If it is him, he's got to be bluffing. Then how in hell do he know the sub's gone missing? He's got to be staging this somehow. It's just not possible. My men have already replaced the conventional warheads on the sub's cruise missiles with warheads containing mustard gas. I have the ability to strike at any four cities on the eastern seaboard from the sub's current position. My people tell me that you can push a button that will destroy your eyes in the sky, Iris One. Then I give you 24 hours to push that button, or I'll push money. Your only choice is to decide what you lose, a few satellites, or millions of innocent lives. <clears throat> you wanted a war, you got one. I'll be in touch. <laughs> Ah, oh, come on. He's got to be bluffing about that. Would you take a chance on that, Ted? Would you? If we nuke it, it won't matter whether or not he's bluffing. If he's on the open sea, sure. But what if he's parked 25 miles off the coast of D.C.? Okay. What have we got here? We've got the quietest sub in the world poised to strike the eastern seaboard with chemical weapons. What I want to know is what the hell are we going to do about it, huh? Skip Lang. Skip, Norm Henshaw here. If you and the boys are up for another crack at Salvatore, we've got a real situation here. We've decided to strike directly at him. Unfortunately, there's no time to mobilize and deploy a large force. Naturally, your unit was at the top of the list.
Admiral Earnshaw. No, I will be honored to cooperate in every way possible, Signor. See. And I give you my personal guarantee that everything will go smoothly, sir. Oh, the President is very, very grateful, personally. And, uh, buenas noches. Thank you, goodbye. Boriega assures me everything will be in place for Operation Track by the time Delta arrives. Norm, this is my protege, Ariana Decker. She helped me design and install the safeguards for the Iris One network. She also had a hand in the computer enhancements on the Roosevelt. Captain, too bad you weren't around to help with the SSIX. Well, we're pretty sure we know who Salvatore's appointment was on that. Here, let me show you. Sure. down to business. Now, as you know, Salvatore's grumpy fingers reach into every nook and cranny of the Colombian military. So open communication to base is out of the question. Out of the question. I know it's contrary to standard procedure, but that's the way that this op's going down. Any questions? Where are we staging from? It's a small town called San Cristobal. We'll ride a train in across the tracks into his territory. We'll slip up under his nose. And kick him in the fucking teeth. I love that. Kilo Alpha 914, completed one. All automation systems normal. Bearing 072, range 44,000. Automated systems responding accordingly. Turning. phases to this stuff. Phase one, infiltrate the compound, locate the target. Phase two, capture and or eliminate the target. This will be our optimal LZ here. As we cross the border, we are secondary. So any questions? Captain? Yeah. Approximately Six minutes away from the border. <clears throat> Let's synchronize our watches to 0700 hours in five, four, three, two, one.
Bene. Bayernse. Bayernse. Rapido. Vamano. Salga. 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 Purchase any information. Yes. You sound like a smart man, Admiral. Everybody makes a mistake from time to time, man. It's human nature. And yours was wasting your time planning a strike against me when you could have put that time to better use convincing your president to destroy Iris One. Speaking of time, Admiral is ticking away. You have eight hours to get President Farrington to pull the plug on Iris One. Boriega. I'd say we're looking up a dead horse's rectum, Norm. Yeah.
loves you, baby, and loves you. So, General Borrega, tell me about the train. So, where are they now? someone else now. Over here, Cap. What is it? Uh, Hutch, Vickers, download this punk. Mac, Doc, come with me. Hi, Howie. I'm Hutch. That's Vickers. Hey, I only have one question. Where is this up? Uh... Material pop. <laughs> I know that you have a calm link, so I know you're talking to the south. How? Oh, you guys are really the... Now, 
I'm getting somewhere. Get your ass over there and call them off. You want help? They were only supposed to set up the equipment and take over. They should prove us now. Don't you patronize me. What do you mean? in the system to completely automate the sub. That's what Salvatore wanted. So what would happen if his demands were met? Fuck, I don't know! And I liked him. I want you to tell me again. Yes, it's I am. Only Salvatore knows the code. Jackers were supposed to. We know that! He asked you where the Roosevelt was headed. Where's the sub? Gentlemen, get 
this loser out of here. Sir, what the hell are you on? You can't. You can't break radio I have to break protocol, man. Kev, you remember the order. We have no choice. Kev, listen to it's me. It's a matter of national security. Track leader to nobility base. Track leader to nobility base. Do you read? <laughs> Get up, goddamn. Come on in, Skip. Let's hear it. Emma Rancho, we boarded the ambush on the train without incident, but uh, some Tory got away. Shit. However, we did grab the thing. Did you get the code? Negative. And sir, it looks like the Roosevelt is headed to New York City. New York City? Okay, Skip, uh, change of plan. Rendezvous ASAP on board the USS Coral Sea. I'll update the president. Nobility base, out. Mr. Howard Thing. Yes, sir. Howdy, Gramps. Um, I really need my medicine. Uh, talking about these, sir. Uh, we took them off him at the villa. Whatever they are, he's got a pretty strong habit going. She's on a holding pattern up in New York Bay. And our course of action. Well, I've got to get you boys on board, don't I? <clears throat> You're wasting your time. Even if you get past those hijackers, you're never going to override the program. Get that thing out of here. I'm going to talk to my lawyer. I still got rights, you know. I'm an American citizen for Christ's sake. Well, Captain, at least we stand a chance of finding the sub. And then what, sir? Look, I know Howard. Maybe I can talk to him. Maybe we should think about evacuation. Evacuating what, General? Just cause the submarine's heading for New York doesn't mean New York's the target. Hey, Howard. You're looking better than ever. Wish I could say the same. <coughs> you said Salvatore is the only one who knows the code to remotely access your automation system. That's what I said. What about overriding it from inside the sub? What about it? Howard. Don't be like that. Help me, and I'll help you. How? If you cooperate, I can fix it to where you're not wearing a tutu for some 300-pound murderer named Spike. You're gonna have to do better than that, Ariana. I look great in a tutu. I bet you do. 
that you'd like one of these right about now, wouldn't you, Howard? What would you do with it? Let it slowly dissolve in your tongue? No. But you chew it to a fine paste. So it get in your bloodstream a little faster. Like I said, you help me. And I'll help you. Each major system has its own program. They can each be shut down individually. How? Oh. By entering the right codes. Okay. Huh. Can I please have my pill? What do you got yourself hooked on, Howard? Painkillers? <gasps> Choke on the Very funny! Will you do your fucking bitch? I never do a mess with you assholes! Never trust a fucking woman! Especially one named Ariana! Oh. Excellent work, Ariana. Thank you, sir. I'd like you to meet Delta Team One. Hello. Well, Captain, this is the unit that's going to get you on board that submarine. What? Marcus. Uh, I'm really not ready for this. One of us has to go. The Navy may be building quieter and quieter submarines, but they're still not equipping them with wheelchair ramps. Oh. You're the best person for the job, you know that.
Check the aft escape hatch.
Make sure there's no heat sensor booby traps. Trip wire. Doc, I need you to look at some top shot. Yes, sir. See anything, Hutch? Uh, negative on explosive devices, Captain. You all right? Nothing yet, Captain. Captain! One down. Mac! What the hell is this? That's goodbye, New York. In just under 30 minutes, President Farrington will stand before the leaders of the world and deliver the keynote speech for the 1998 Drudge Summit. For days now, pundits have been predicting that the speech will serve as a platform for a major announcement. But as has been the case all week long, no one in the White House will even hint at what the announcement might be. Although this morning, a source promised that it would be, quote, History making. Captain? What is it? None of the codes they gave us were accepted. What? No, I don't think he did. Salvatore's hijackers must have changed them. Let's just trash the friggin' mainframe. No, I know how a thing works. I'm sure he's incorporated some safeguards to make this whole system sabotage proof. We have 28 minutes, gentlemen. Matt, man the helm. Sir. Attempt a manual override. Doc, what do you have for me? Still got nothing. Gotta do better than that. I need to speak with Henshaw immediately. Yes, sir. Cap? What's the problem? We got nothing. Hutch? Sir. Prepare the emergency blow system. Yes, sir. Everybody hold on, go on the side. Brace yourself. Ready to fly. In. Three, two, one, blow! Hutch? Uh, no response, Captain. Let's go again. Sir! Okay. In. Three, two, one, blow! <laughs> This is Team 1. One ship. Gotta reboot the system. System's rebooted. We have a frequency. Mobility base. Do you copy? This is Team 1 over. Admiral, they've secured the car. You're on speaker. This is Nobility Base, Captain. You shut the system down? Thank you, Admiral. The codes weren't accepted. The hijackers somehow transposed Thane's emergency fail-safe sequence numbers. Captain, can you at least tell which cities the missiles are targeting? Negative, sir. Ariana's trying to work on that program now. Prepare to fallback contingency. Keep us posted. Nobility base, out. Hutch and Vickers, move to weapons locker. See what you can do to disengage the firing mechanism. Matt, and done. 
Take care of Ariana. Sir. the area of contamination? Well, uh, based on the size of that sphere, depending on how many there are, I mean, uh, I'd say we're looking at Manhattan, minimum. That's 10 million people, which dead people.
feel safe? Feel safe? Mm hmm. Oh, you are clever. You are clever. <laughs> Drugs. What are you talking about, Captain? There's a biological bomb and three Tomahawk missiles on board, sir. All prepped and hot. They're headed for the UN. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, presidents, prime ministers, it is with the utmost pleasure that I stand before you today as the bearer of remarkable news. News of an historic turning point in the worldwide war on drugs. We got the helm. Vicks, sir, have we got enough water to turn this baby around? Yes, sir. Hard to port, sir. Hard to port! Keep it hard. Keep it hard over. Hard over! Convincingly demonstrated. Keep 100! Hold on! Ah, well, 
this potent no weapon. We're clear, Captain, we're clear! Clear! Victory in the war against drugs is ours. Thank you, gentlemen. Now for the bomb. Give me good news, Hutch. We've got a tanker dead ahead. Can we avoid her? It'll be tight. Give him the codes for this triggering mechanism. Hold on. Yep, we got a problem. This clock's gone crazy. It's just jumped from 11 to 9. There's too many codes. The odds are against us. Come on, Ariana. You're better than that. Don't that little tur. There's got to be something. Seven minutes. Three minutes. Come on! Look, soldier, we have done our job. You have got to get in this guy's head. You've got to think like they thinks. What motivates him? What makes him tick? Is it money, power, greed? The job? What is it? God damn it! What is it? Good 
Wars. Hey, Cap. Good God, Sergeant. Yeah. This sub, uh, sir, she's, uh, she's breaking up. Vix, need a hand, please. Nobility base, nobility base, this is team one. We have a slight dilemma, sir. Some appears to be taking on a lot of water. We have, however, defused the biological bomb, but it appears as though we won't be able to contain her speed. She's run away, sir. Admiral Henshaw, sir. Presently, we are in possession of eight spheres of a Airborne biological virus, sir. We have not had time to defuse the tomahawks. Set your wheels in three, five, three. Your priority is to get those chemicals off that vessel. Abandon ship. That is an order. You heard the people were abandoning ship. Set the course for three, five, three. Let's get the hell out of here. Three, five, three. Lock. Three, five, three, sir. in the seal. What? The coupling's cracked. Must have happened when we scraped the bridge. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Hold down his first. Come in. Come. Matt, get the hell up here. We'll go to the tanks. Cap. Matt, but you know to get up here. Cap. What? Coupling shot. We're not going anywhere. We're all going to die. Plus what? Feed my cat, Cap. Ah! Ah! It's out of
Okay. Come on, buddy. Keep your head down. Good job. Yeah. Hey, soldier. What? No mouth to mouth? <laughs>
telling me that 24 men have died attempting the same mission. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 